guys, welcome back to the kitchen. We're always cooking up videos. Today is another update video. It is day 11. If you saw my last video, you guys know what I've been going through. But uh, I will say it is feeling a lot better. But I gotta open up the wrap and see how open it is. Ooh, I'm starting to dread changing the wrap because I never know what to expect. Okay, okay. Some dead skin did come off again. It's looking a lot better. I'm gonna go unravel the cream. We'll see what it looks underneath. <laughs> okay, so basically like the bottom half of the arm, take off the dried cream underneath is still pretty raw. So I just went ahead and put some more cream on right away. I didn't want to show you guys cause I didn't want like the air and all the bacteria in the air to uh, get into it. I, I touched it slightly and it still hurt quite a bit, so um, still gotta monitor this thing. I'm gonna go wrap it up and I'll get back to it. And I'll tell you guys what the doc actually told me, so hold up. <laughs> I went to the doctor for follow up and the doctor basically told me, also my hair is super long right now. The doctor told me I've been doing a good job keeping this nice and clean and away from infection. So I asked her how long this is gonna take to recover and she told me two to three weeks more. The nurse was also telling me it's more so to be on the safe side since it is still pretty open and raw right now and there's still a high chance of infection. Basically, I just had to wait for this to be closed. I just had to play it day by day and I mean, if it closes by tomorrow, I'm good to go. I've been stuck in the house basically. I mean, I could go out, but also, knowing my luck this year, I'm not trying to trying to mess with it and have this be infected. Anyways, that's a quick update. Probably update you guys. If anything changes, if not, I might see you guys in a couple days. Bye. What's up guys? This is an update because I'm just super bummed today. My brother is graduating. He's graduating with his PhD and I cannot be there today. I actually had a flight there and I had to cancel it because uh, they told me I couldn't travel with his arm. I'm about to FaceTime him here in a little bit. He's walking right now as we speak. My parents have been sending me pictures and videos. It looks super cool. Actually, no, it really does. It kind of looks boring. My brother actually called me and told me I don't really have to come. It's only going to be like like 30 minutes of him on stage and then the rest of the time is just kind of walking around the city in the sun and especially the doctor was like don't put this in the sun can't let it like sweat overheat and whatnot etc etc i didn't think this would have that much of an impact on my life the fact that like i'm literally missing like a huge milestone it just sucks really bad but um, I'll show you guys a picture of me being there. I told my family to take a picture of them and leave room for me so I can photoshop myself in. <laughs> I'm FaceTiming my brother right now as you guys can see. He's getting his PhD, just graduated. I'm right back. I'm just a little bit concerned of this portion right here because it's like bleeding a little bit still. I can see like juices a little bit coming out and it's like yellow still. Everything else looks like it's coming along just fine. I think I'm gonna try to clean most of this off today and see what it looks underneath. I'll give you guys an update in a bit. Here it is right now. Like I was assuming that that middle part is still super raw. It's kind of bloody right now. It is stinging so bad right now, so I'm gonna cover it up. But I just wanna show you guys a quick update. The bottom half is looking a lot better though, not gonna lie. But it's just that middle part that needs, it just needs to cover up now. All right, it's been over like two weeks now. My hair is getting so long that I gotta start putting in a knot. <laughs> oh, anyways. You vlogging right now? Yeah. Um, Are you vlogging, dude? <laughs> the bottom half, it's healing nicely, but the middle part and the top half, um, I was finally able to get the dead skin off. So I've been leaving Walter. trails of myself you're like, around a house. You're like a lizard when they shed their skin. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, it is feeling a lot better. It still hurts, it stings. Anytime I sweat or like do anything physical, then this thing starts burning. Also, again, update from my car. The car is delayed, of course, of course. So I was like, you know, it's all good, it's all good because I can't even really drive right now. Give me another week or two and I'll be good to pick it up. <laughs> That's today's update. I'll see you guys in the next one. Ah! It's been about two and a half weeks since uh, I burned my arm. It's feeling a lot better. And while I've been injured, I've actually been watching how to play Golden Hour. It's here on the phone right now. I gotta say, I, I just got this keyboard like last week, I believe. I love music. I used to play piano for like 10 plus years when I was a kid. Uh, we'll see if I can remember some of it just from like watching videos. 
Oh, yeah, okay. All right, I, I do remember. So the left hand goes something like this. The right hand. I think that that's kind of sounds like it. Ooh, hold up. It started stinging. I got to take like a 30 second break. I think I got the first part, not like 100%, like I said, let me know how it sounds. Hey, I'm actually pretty happy with how that turned out for the first day. I am gonna go rest now for a little bit. See you guys on uh, the next update. This is what friends are for, guys. Perfection. Heck yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's great, man. It's nice getting out of the house. Oh, uh, yeah, I mean, it feels good not to be stuffy and locked up in the room. All right, guys, I got the arm sling thanks to Ryan, and now it is time. Oh, man. Yo! <laughs> I'm back! What up, dude? What up, man? How you doing? Good, good. Uh, it's good to be back, guys. First person I've seen today is Drew, my ah. man. All right, I gotta go find some more people. Hey, man. How are you? <laughs> I'd hug you, but I don't want to break it. Hey. Uh, good to see you. Car's the last person I haven't seen yet. <laughs> you shocked that I'm here again? Yeah, I never thought I'd see you again. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I've gone forever. <laughs> three days and it is uh it's turned black so gotta clean that out real quick Oof. okay well I'm gonna wrap this up and hopefully by the end of this week I can show you guys something that looks like uh, a normal arm again so today is a uh, checkup day we're going to the doctor and we're gonna see what they say hopefully they say it it's looking a lot better and I don't have to take any more medicine, no more antibiotics. Let's head on over there. We have arrived. Let's see what they say. Yeah, that's gonna take a while to go in, <laughs> but it's doing okay. I mean, there's no signs of infection. You're doing a good job. So the white stuff in between is where it's trying to grow new skin. And what's, what's the red part? That's just the raw meat. At this point, you just have to deal with the discomfort. I mean, it's been, what, three weeks? I'm at the doctor's now. They completely cleaned it. This side over here, uh, there's a lot of yellow liquid that just came out, and it hurt like crazy right now. Well, guys, it's officially been one month since I've burned this arm, and I thought it would have been fully healed by now, like a month later. You guys heard the doctor. It's still kind of um, got that raw meat to it. It's gonna suck still. It's gonna be uncomfortable and it's still gonna be leaking. I will update you guys with another video and hopefully in that video, this is gonna be completely covered. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you everyone for all the support and love I've had for the past month. We're almost there, so pray for snow. Till next time, peace.